today's video, I'm gonna take you through a training session with me and how I use my programming. Um, today's programming set five sets of three with pinky grip, touch and go uh, at RPE 8. So I did my first set at 140kg right there. Well, that was too low RPE, so I moved up to 142.5 here. Did three reps here and it was still below RPE 8. So then I moved up to 145 and did three, three reps here. And that was around RPE 7.5 to 8, still in the lower end. So I kept it at 145 for one more set here. The reason that I'm doing these uh, pinky grip slash close grip um, touch and go bench press is to get the same movement in uh, with some variation just for getting new getting a little different stimulus and uh, also to get more hypertrophy in, in the same movement patterns, patterns as my normal bench press. Here's my last set 140 for free um, which was the back off from the 145 still around RPE 8 so right now I only have one day with regular deadlifts, so that day I have a lot of singles. This day it was 6 sets of 1 at 245kg. Um, here is 220kg, moved very very well. Uh, I tried a little different technique after using the deadlift bar and it clearly worked really well. Um, here is my first single at 245, which moved really good. It actually moved so good that I decided to ask my coach if I could just move up to 260. So he said uh, I could do that and here is 260. Still moved very easy, um, a lot easier than 245 last week. So I just kept it at 260 for the last singles here. These all moved really well. Um, I think right now my max would be around 290 to 300 actually. Um, somewhere in that range um, and it will most likely go up a lot more with this new technique that I'm trying out and then I ended up the session with some tricep push downs and bicep curls and I tried to keep these fairly clean the gains to fatigue ratio needs to be as good as possible 